But here we go. Atchison, Kansas, thank you. From the very bottom of my heart, we're here at the we're here at the end. We're done. My friends, I wanted to stop by and I want to say thank you. As I was invited into your community, I was excited to return. I was excited to come back. I've been a fan of your community for a while. And then after the community reached out to me and shared with me the uh, past couple weeks and the two losses, I was hurting for you. Now I was excited and honored you invited me back. And so here I am, Friday night, about 9 p.m. We started at about 6.50 in the morning yesterday. And uh, I finished with your principal at very close to midnight. And then I was back at school at 7 a.m. this morning with your superintendent, your principal, middle school principal, and uh, some other people on the administrative team. We got to spend some quality time together talking about the school, the, the building, the facilities. And it's now 9 p.m. And I'm just finishing having dinner with your principal and his beautiful wife. I want to start by saying, number one, thank you, community, for reaching out to me. I'm humbled. I'm honored. I want to thank Sean. Sean, the Boys and Girls Club. That young man is an amazing man. That Boys and Girls Club, they're locked on. It was beautiful, beautiful. Sean's my contact that brought all of this to fruition. Um, Sean, it was a pleasure, my friend. It was a pleasure. You, you're a hero, Sean. You did good. I want to thank the Rotary Club, my friends. I'm sorry that I was in and out with you yesterday. I want to thank each and every one of you for being change agents in the community and caring so much. I want to thank the whole administrative team of Atchison Community Schools. My first impression walking into the school yesterday at 6.50 and having our meeting, I knew right then it's a home run. I knew right then home run. I had your superintendent sitting right next to me, the high school principal down there, the counselors. and I, you, I'll tell you all, should be very, very appreciative that you have such a strong administrative team that cares about your kids. That was a beautiful meeting. My high school assembly, I can't even begin to tell you, two hours in the gymnasium. Your kids were amazing. I had a blast. I couldn't believe how many people signed up that wanted to chat afterwards. Folks, I didn't get a chance to eat. I didn't get a chance to pee in two days. Sorry I said that. That's all right. I love it, man. Now I went over and talked to the middle school. Love the middle school kids. Middle school, I'm sorry I didn't get a chance. It was the end of the day. You can imagine a lot was going on. The teachers, I couldn't wait to talk to them. They were great. Had some meaningful conversation. The parents, what a great turnout last night. Here's my recap, my friends. <clears throat> Yesterday, I was worried. I was concerned that you're not done. I probably met and uh, I can't even begin to tell you. I had kids all day yesterday. I had kids all day today wanting to talk and just. I loved you guys. I love that my heart can be present with your heart. You felt safe. And you just wanted to share. You just wanted to sit. You just wanted to be present. I was so super impressed with all of you. But I want you to understand, my friends, as I asked many of you why you don't ask for help, and many of you 
I don't know. I just don't like to talk to anybody. And then I said to you, well, why do you feel comfortable and safe talking to me? And most all of you said, well, you just, you seem really cool. Like you, you get us. I want you to understand that all these trusted adults in your life, if you give them the same opportunity, I think you're going to find that you can trust them too. As I'm leaving your community, your high school principal said to me, says, Jeff, when all this is said and done, I think the one thing that I would really want is I would want to know that every kid in my building knows that they have a trusted adult that they can reach out to. I think we accomplished that. And I want to ask you, young people, don't ever be afraid to ask for help. And young people that know their friends that might be hurting, if your friend is hurting and they're not opening up, don't you be afraid to go talk to someone for your friend. That's the responsible thing to do. To the whole school community that's feeling the pain and the loss of Josh and Tanner. My friends, I'm deeply sorry. I understand the pain. I hope that the time has come where together we're all realizing, okay, can't change this. We can't bring them back. We need to move forward and we can't let this define us. I trust that you know that my intentions are pure and I don't mean to be insensitive as I say that. You're a beautiful school community. You're a beautiful community. I'm a huge fan. I had a great, great, great I'm so honored. My visit was amazing. Atchison School Community, all the administrators, all the teachers, all the staff members, all of the beautiful parents, most importantly, all you beautiful young people. I love you. I thank you. My visit was amazing. I'm I'm a huge fan. Don't be afraid to reach out to me. I'll always be here for you. Thanks so much, my friends. Thank you for accepting me in your community and letting me have the time that I had. I'm I'm just, I'm, I'm beyond words. My heart is here, but yo, I'm going home for a day and a half. Take care.